A group of prominent Republicans, including some from right here in Michigan, are threatening to leave the GOP and form a breakaway party. The group is specifically targeting President Trump's policies and his control of the party's platform. Let's get to... Well, Congressman Paul Mitchell here from Michigan left the Republican Party back in December amid President Trump's efforts to overturn the election. Now, this group doesn't have so much demands as they do a wish list of ideas and deep pockets, and they say they plan to put their money where their mouth is. Enough already. Look what we've done to our country in 10 years. Former Congressman Paul Mitchell speaking from his farm about the launch of a new group he helped found called A Call for American Renewal. The former Republican and 149 other current and former party members all signing on to a list of principles like truth, ethical government, and the rule of law. The idea started just days after Mitchell left the Republican Party. We need a healthy two-party system, maybe three parties, but we clearly need a healthy two parties. And the Republican Party is not healthy right now. The group's members include former governors, members of Congress, presidential advisors, and party officials who have all agreed their party needs to be fixed or challenged by a new party entirely. Mitchell says the focus is on the everyman, the people who simply want to work and live without having to worry about getting lost in political games. I think the majority of the country's in the middle. They don't agree on everything, but you know what? They want, they don't necessarily think that there's one solution, but I hate to put this way, damn it, they want something done. And he says they plan to be involved. We're going to support candidates, Republicans, independents, Democrats, that commit to doing that. We will engage in elections. We will engage in identifying candidates and helping fund candidates and, their, and, their, and structure their, their campaigns even. Now, this announcement of this group came just one day after House Republicans ousted Congresswoman Liz Cheney from her leadership position. I was only able to talk to two of Michigan's Republicans in Congress, Fred Upton, whose office says he supported Cheney, and Lisa McLean, who was the successor to Paul Mitchell. She voted to remove Cheney. Jason. All right, Grant, thanks.